What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Today is another motivational one and I want to talk about failure. In Too often in life we are often more worried about failing at a task, whatever it may be, be it work, be it family commitment, whatever it may be. We are more concerned about failing than completing it. We could be in a situation where we're actually not doing too bad, whatever task or project it may be. But because of one small mistake or errors here and there, we are already thinking we're going to fail. If we have that mentality, we're going to unfortunately fail. However, what people need to remember, there's a chance to get back up and do better the next time. In school, there are kids that fail grades. Yes, it's tough. Yes, it's hard watching your friends go through and you sit back. But you get, you've got another chance to do better and probably do better than you've ever done in your life because you've got that kick up the backside to work harder and to the best of your ability. And from that lesson learned, you're going to be probably exceeding in everything you do because of that mistake. Same goes for a work, um, a work project or in your working environment. Whatever you, you do, your manager may come back to you and critique your work or whatever it may be. That doesn't mean you failed, guys. It just means make the changes. Go get back, go back to the drawing board and do your research and your work over so you can nail it the next time. If the project's a complete failure, then either you need to look into what you have done. Have you worked hard enough? Or were you sitting around on the TV, on your computer, on your phone, or whatever it may be? You need to ask those questions. Because if you failed but working hard, then you've got to ask for help or assistance, or get your manager to get the feedback that you may need in order to move forward. But at the end of the day, if you fail at something, just remember, try harder the next time. Don't let that be your choice to forget about whatever it may be. You could have the greatest project right in your hands, but because of one small mistake that makes you think you're going to fail at it, you're going to drop it and throw it and walk away on something that could have maybe taken you to the next level in life or in your career or be it within your family. Don't let tiny mistakes take over your life. Don't let a person's decision make your decision change because they think they're better than you or whatever it may be. Because you might have just made the tiniest error. Just remember, work harder. If a person is rude in order to critique you, then you know what? Stuff them. You just go back and listen to what your manager has to say or what your clients have to say. But make sure you do it the right way in a respectable manner. Don't let it destroy you. You watch so many things go wrong. People are so close to either passing an exam and all that stuff. But what, what do you do? You're constantly panicking. Oh, I'm going to fail or I'm going to do badly. At the end of the day, some people don't fail and do 10 times better than they thought. Or some do. But those that do, don't let it be the end of your life. Get back up and move forward and do better the next time. That's the point of retrying and keeping on trying and never giving up. And so you can um, go back on those opportunities and do better the next time. Don't let life's challenges get you down. Don't let failure defeat you. You can do anything no matter what it is. You just need to believe in yourself. And have the patience in order while doing it. People start from small. And if they have the patience, they grow their businesses to levels they never thought they'd ever reach in their wildest dreams. Be those people. Whatever the opportunity may be. Whether it's studying. If you want to study further, but you're too worried about, are you going to make it? Go give it a try. Go work hard. Go work to the best of your best of your ability and you know what if you're struggling ask for help there's nothing wrong with extra maths or extra um, uh, teachers help I did it and look where I am I got through it all I've done a lot of mistakes and failed at a, quite a few things in life be it subjects or um, uh, things that modules that you have to redo, redo but it's those modules that made me stronger it's those mistakes that have made me the person I am today and it's those errors that make me want to correct them going out in life. Last week I had a challenging week because I, you know, I let the pressure get to me. 
for silly, silly errors. That was my own doing because I didn't concentrate and work to the best of my ability. Um, maybe the critique from the other side wasn't that motivating enough, but you know what? At the end of the day, it was my doing. I didn't get up and work to the best, so I had to suffer for that. Well, not suffer. I didn't suffer, but I suffered through myself because I knew I'm better than that. And the next week I did, I tried again and I did better than I thought I would do. But that's the goal. Don't stop. Don't stop believing. Keep fighting. Keep going for those dreams. Because it's those dreams that are going to take you to places you never even thought you would ever get to in your life. Keep believing. Keep fighting, guys, and never give up. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's just something that I wanted to talk about because it's an experience that I experienced this past week. But I thought it was a nice message to share with you guys. Don't be afraid to fail. If you fail, try harder next time. If you enjoyed this video, hit that thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button so we can continue this awesome growth of this channel. I passed 300. I never thought I'd get there. I'm on 310 or something now. Great growth. Thanks for the support. But let's continue to grow so we can help inspire and motivate many more people in the world. Thanks for watching. Stay safe and never give up. Cheers.